upcoming have a face cam on it so basically as you can see the game looks really good it's running that's basically how you capture the game it's really simple you just want to create a new source what's up guys my name is alex i'm looking to a new video and you guys may know or may notice that my voice is a little um, because I have actually a sore throat so actually I have some tea right here with some honey and this is gonna be a moment that's gonna be worth it so yeah that was worth it so I have actually a sore throat but that doesn't stop me I mean I can feel it however I want I'm still gonna create videos whatsoever even though my voice is fucked up or something I don't know I just I want to make videos for you guys of course and uh, today I'm gonna show you guys how to record Black Ops 3 so you know Black Ops 3 released not that long ago I don't know maybe I think a few months I don't know apparently Call of Duty Black Ops 3 was released on November 6 2015 my bad. And I'm gonna show you guys how to record it with OBS, of course. And then after you can just, you know, put it in Sony Vegas. Um, so I would say let's get started. All right, so as you can see, we're on OBS as always. And the first thing you wanna do is you wanna create a new scene because you want to record, you know, Black Ops 3. So I just made a new scene, as you can see right here, that says Black Ops 3. I'm gonna click on preview stream so I can see what we're doing. Basically, the next thing you want to do is you want to boot up the game first. So do not create a source already. Launch the game first. That's what I'm gonna do right now. I'm just gonna bl uh, launch Black Ops 3 first because the thing is, it wouldn't work when you just, when you first create, you know, the source and then the actual game. It doesn't work that way. So I'm just gonna wait until Steam is loaded until the game is booted up. Boom, so there we have the game. So now that Black Ops 3 is fully loaded and started, you wanna go to, you wanna Alt Tab. And you want to go back to OBS, as you can see. And I'm just gonna, you know, mute the sound of the game because it actually, it's, it looks like it's pretty loud. Okay, the next thing you want to do is you just want to, you want to capture uh, the game. So what you want to do is you want to go to your scene and you want to click on Sources, you want to click on Add. And you want to use game capture for this because Black Ops 3, we all know it, it's a it's a huge game. I don't know, 50, 60 gigabytes. So it's gonna lag and you know do all kinds of stuff in other capture modes. So you want to just use uh, the game capture one. You want to call this. Let's just call this game. Boom. And then what you want to do is you want to pick Call of Duty in this list. So you want to want to look for it until you've found it and i think it is this one and to avoid black bars and all that kind of stuff uh, around your uh, uh, game uh, you want to click on stretch image to screen and ignore the aspect radio that's going to stretch it until it's you know fit in the screen you want to click on okay <laughs> there it is it looks really really good and there's a little bit of lag because actually this is just a really really uh, heavy game i have two instances of obs running at the same time as you can see the quality is really good and that's basically how you capture it so let's just let's go a little bit more more into the actual game boom and as you can see we're in the game and it looks pretty pretty good and i assume that you guys also want to have a face cam on it so basically as you can see the game looks really good it's running that's basically how you capture the game it's really simple you just want to create a new source you can switch back and forth between window capture and game capture which is what works for you the best there we have the game as you can see it's really epic so what you want to do you want to add a face cam that's no problem go back to obs so as you can see the game boom there we have the game i'm just gonna show you guys how to add a face cam so basically the next thing you want to do is you want to click on add you want to click on a uh, video capture device and you want to just let's just let's call this face cam boom and the next thing you want to do is you want to you know capture uh, choose your uh, i have just only one so i'm just going to click, uh, click this one c920 and basically the next thing you want to do is you just want to click on um basically you want to leave everything so, you know to reduce lag just just leave everything how it is boom like this then we're going to press an okay there's me now what you want to do is you want to click on um, edit scene and you want to make this smaller as you can see like this i'm just gonna place this let's say this is a good position right right here that's actually a pretty cool cool position maybe a little bit smaller that sounds pretty good so i have the face cam right there i have my game right here it looks pretty good so in order to make this a little bit more cool i'm just gonna show you guys how to add a face cam border as well so the next thing you want to do that's actually just a little frame around it so the next thing what you want to do is click, uh, right click on the sources you want to add an image and you want to call this face cam border or how you want to call you can call this whatever you want so click on okay now we want to choose your image. Boom, I, pick, I picked a white image and as you can see, it's way too big. So I'm just gonna make it smaller and it, does, it doesn't look like a face cam border at all. Yeah, I know. The thing you want to do is you want to have this under your face cam. So you want to click on the face cam border. You want to hold control and arrow down. 
boom and it's underneath it now you can start making you know the border how thick you want it so i'm just gonna um skip this part because actually it looks pretty it's pretty detailed so i'm just gonna uh put it in real quick and then i'll just go from there so i'll catch you guys in like a few seconds until this actually is uh done really 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 yeah you know good enough i can't talk but okay let's go 12 seconds later okay so actually i just made it a little bit you know around it not a new i, I want to have all the lines as you can see this line and the lines on the side here and at the bottom i want to have that the same thickness so that's so that looks pretty good so that's actually pretty basic but you know a cool technique to add a face cam and basically i think you're set on that part i mean you, if you have you have the face cam on the right so we're now in full screen mode and it looks really 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 awesome so that's basically it this is how you add a face cam a border and now actually i think you can just start recording straight away it looks pretty good so that's as similar to this guys you just want to add in the face cam the border and then you can just go back to your game and start gaming with a face cam right here and then you have your game as well uh, captured and that's as simple it is so that is how easy it is guys you just want to add the face cam add the face cam border capture the game you can switch back and forth between game capture um, you can use window capture if you want to but the bad thing about window capture is that it's going to cap capture everything so for example we have like the game and you have uh, a freaking skype notification at the bottom it, you, you're gonna see that because actually you know the best thing is you can use game capture because it's made for games but if you have lag or it doesn't work for you uh you can just use uh the window capture as well so thank you guys for watching this was this was amazing if you guys want to see more of those videos every tuesday at 12 p.m pst make sure to subscribe down below i thank you guys for watching uh, and liking on this video x you know nonetheless i'm not sick i just have like a sore throat i don't, I don't know where it's going you guys can expect videos i don't care how i feel i just want to create videos that's basically you know what i wanted to do so i thank you guys for watching i'll catch you guys uh, tomorrow for a certain vegas tutorial so i will see you guys tomorrow what's happening guys my name is alex awesome that you guys are watching to this new video 12 pm is 9 pm ct i'm gonna answer four of your questions Real special i wanted to announce that the academy series is done my name is lbj interfacial what up I'm filming. Okay, so as you can see, previous week we did a collaboration. It's awesome that you guys are watching to this new video, this new reaction to my first video kind of video.